Hello. I got a bunch of commissions randomly over the past few days for my small crochet business. And I was like, wow, I have no materials. So. before or after getting gas? I'm thinking before. Hi, can I get a venti peach green tea refresher, please? All right, I'm now at Michael's to go get, ah, let's drop my keys, my crochet stuff. What are you doing? Sorry, I thought my car was about to get back there too. They have the full stuff out. Little pumpkins. I love fall so much. There's something like sunflowers are like my favorite flower. Sunflowers and peonies are my two favorite flowers. And the fall stuff at Michael's always is like two flowers and like sunflowers in there. I just stop myself from buying it every time. We have secured the five pound thing of polyfill that literally fills my trunk. They also got this for my flag next year. And I got a coupon. All right, I'm back home. I've put on my comfy crochet outfit. Try and finish two of my commissions today. First one is this, which looks very bizarre, but it's actually a hat for one of my coworkers' dogs because one of my friends is gonna make hats for her cats, which is adorable. This is hat number one, it's like a little frog. And this one's supposed to be a flower, which I think it looks like a flower, but I also have been looking at it and it kind of looks like a grape or an eggplant. So I'm making that one, it's like a little bumblebee. I'm just gonna sit on the couch and find a show to watch. I done i just made these little wings that i'm gonna i was debating sewing but i am gonna hot glue because if it's going to a dog i kind of want them to be really secure and the stuff will show through on this side i think that'll look very bad but then i have another commission that i need to work on also requires hot glue so we're gonna finish that one at the same time it's a commission from a friend for her friend that loves the movie tangled and so she asked me if i could make the little i think i think it's a lily from the tangled movie and i was like absolutely so i need to take these and hot glue these in and then i have bamboo skewers i think i'm gonna hot glue the green yarn which i think i'm going to regret and i may have to paint them but it's fine because i have a hundred of them literally so i just figured i'm gonna get all my hot gluing that at one i was gonna start filming and hot glue and then the hot glue started kind of leaking so i've just stuck the wing on the hat. I actually centered them. I was kind of rushing, but I think I centered them pretty well. So first I have to make sure, so this is the pointy bit at the end. So I have to make sure I'm lining everything up. And then this is a pointy bit. So this goes there. Take some hot glue. I feel like I'm a little over generous with the glue on this one, but whatever. Stick it on. That works so well. Wait, I'm actually a genius. All right, everything is hot glued and assembled i'm just like running it cool off and see if there's any parts i need to go over and this is like cooled look at it's like on there good very excited about that i'm beyond disappointed right now because the flowers just aren't working. They're just laying flat like a pancake and look like a blob. And I just don't see the point in wasting any more time and resources and energy on them. So I've messaged the girl that has ordered them from me and been like, here's a sitch. And it's frustrating to me because I don't know why they're not working out. So I'm making, this is tulip number one. I'm gonna make, I think, five. Cause I'm making one in white right now and I'm gonna make one in yellow. So they're kind of like tangled colors. I'm gonna work on this and watch something fun and relaxing and drink my sleepy tea in my big Prague. Like look at the size of this mug. It's from Prague. It's a little Starbucks one and I love it. I have made four because I don't think I have enough purple to make another full purple one I was gonna make two of each color but my purple one and then I have this like I don't know what you call this like cream color like a light brown 
and then yellow the top's a little funky on that one i might have to go fix that and then white i'll make the stems for them tomorrow but that's all the crochet i have for gym Good morning, here is, ooh, this is start throwing stuff around. I think I need to start making these for markets because they're adorable. And I have the skewers and I have some old paint. So we're gonna paint my skewers because I don't feel like gluing yarn to them. Right there, all done. I'm just gonna leave them to dry because I'm really, really paranoid about getting paint on the flowers themselves. So I'm gonna leave these to dry and then I will glue them. I was also a slowly billy and like painted the ends of these ones and was like, oh no, I can't paint this end. And then realized I don't need to paint this because this is what's like, it's like gonna go into the flower. So it doesn't, it doesn't need to be painted. No one's gonna see it, but I'm gonna wash my hands, clean up this paint and then maybe start on my next commission. So now I have to, I'm gonna hot glue the wings on this one and see if I like hot gluing because maybe I will invest in a hot glue gun. And I put the sticks in the tulips to see what they look like and they look good. So I'm gonna hot glue those in now. And hopefully it's not gonna be a train wreck like yesterday. All right, so that is one order done and dusted. Adorable, I'm obsessed. And then my tulips that are drying. And then I have one more order, but I need to go back to Michael's today because I need black yarn for it. So we get to go back to Michael's. I'm currently, I don't know if you can see it, at another Michael's. However, there's a Winners all the way down there. I'm gonna have to go to Winners today, I think. I'm gonna treat myself. They're playing Taylor Swift in the store right now. I'm excited. Okay, um, I do not like scrapbook or like journal. I've tried a few times. I haven't really stuck to it, but I'm in the sticker aisle. It's looking tempting. Like they got some cute stuff out here. They have like this one. It has like all the constellations on it. Adorable. They have for Banff National Park, which is like two hours away from where I live. They're all so cute. Winter's haul time because I'm a little crazy. I got this to put my cotton balls. I don't use cotton balls. I use like the reusable ones you can wash and my Q-tip. It was like 10 bucks, eight bucks, even better. And then I got a new case for my AirPods. This one I thought was cute. This was $9. And then I got <laughs> I'm a Cliff Bars because this is my favorite flavor. And I start my second job tomorrow. It's just like seasonal work at a festival. So I bought these so I can put them in my purse and not pass out at work. And then I got coffee this is the java works canadian maple i'm almost done their vanilla blend right now and it is and i have their pumpkin spice blend and it is also delicious so i got this for my apartment next year as well so it'll go with my little sign i bought yesterday i want them to make candles of these if you work at java works start making candles because this stuff smells so good and the coffee's so good i also obviously went to michael's and got my ball of yarn so I can start on my last commission. I am sitting down to crochet. I have all my materials with me and I am watching The Righteous Gemstones. Don't know if I like quite yet. So I'm gonna watch two episodes of that and see. And then I'm gonna try and finish my last commission tonight. It is, I don't know if you can see the clock. It is 10.42 and I start my new job tomorrow. I'm calling it a night. All I have left to do is like making the arms and sewing it all together, which will not take that long. But like, look at its little face. That is the freaking cutest thing I've ever seen. And the little ears. All right, I got home from my like work a while ago, but we are now working on the arms. For the cat i have to finish this one and make one more and then we have to sew it up and i'm so excited all right are we ready for the grand reveal look how freaking cute this is adorable this is adorable i want to keep it i can't but i want to if anyone needs me i will be sat here cuddling this cat for the rest of the day because i'm 
obsessed. I think I might have to make one for myself, but because that was my last commission, this is unfortunately the end of this video. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this one. If, if you want me to do more videos about crochet and my commissions and stuff, let me know in the comment section or just give this video a like. And at the time of filming this, I have 205 subscribers. I'm trying to reach 500 by the end of 2023. So if you could please give me a subscribe, I would really appreciate it. If not, it's no big deal. I hope I will see you again sometime really, really soon. And uh, now time for the end of the video tradition. Someone new to introduce you to. My old water bottle had split completely along the bottom and my parents recognized that it was kind of in shambles. So they got me a new one for my birthday, which I've decorated. So we take a sip of our water. We stay happy, we stay healthy, and we are kind to other people. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.